show presented by Bell Bank. I'm your host, Dave Schultz. We're here in the ninth hole at Maple River Golf Club, just minutes west of Fargo. We're on the ninth hole, par three, 150 yards, and on this show, we've got a special one for you folks. It's a celebrity show, Form Communications Company. They brought out their finest, and we're gonna see who can play some golf under the pressure. Now, we know they're comfortable on camera with a microphone in their hand, and they can write a telling story, but can they play golf? Can they play golf on camera? We're gonna find out today, it's gonna to be a lot of fun. The closest shot today will win $1,000 for their charity of choice, thanks to Form Communications Company. Plus, we have the Theraldson Ethanol Pro Shots, and we have our co-host here, Lisa Schwinden. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Dave, how are you? This is gonna be a fun one. Oh, it's gonna be great. We've got some great personalities today, like you said, really good behind the camera, but can they hit golf shots? We'll see. <laughs> there was a question, but I ended up, we ended up, do, it added the insurance. So if one of these contestants makes a hole in one, they're gonna get their choice between a Chevy Camaro and a Chevy Blazer, thanks to Gateway Chevrolet. So they're not gonna make the championship show. This is a standalone show, but there's still a lot on the line for these well, players. It's good for you to cover, just in case, you know. Uh, we do actually have some legit golfers in this group, so for we sure. do expect some good swings out of some of them. So uh, Lisa, great to, great to see you. Thanks for being here on the show. You're the head pro at Osgood, uh, award-winning head golf professional and master professional now, right? Master professional status earned that last year, so nice, uh, good uh, for my resume, I guess. Absolutely, and, and thanks for being here and doing the pro shots. I know it's not easy. You probably don't get to play a lot of golf. 150 yards, each shot you hit on the green will add $250 to the charity prize pool. What do you think? I think this is great. I just got these clubs out of the bag, took the plastic wrap off. First time I've swung them, so we'll see. Uh, I'm sure that if, uh, if it doesn't work, it's definitely the clubs, not me. <laughs> That's right. <As> always. <laughs> it's a fresh, fresh <laughs> nine know. iron. Never been hit before. Uh, you know, the, just need one good swing, right? Let's do it. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Lisa Schwinden. Theraldson Ethanol Pro Shots. Yes, what a beautiful swing. One big bounce. Yep, yep, sit. Oh man, that ran through. Good play, the wind's really picking up. All right, second shot for Lisa. Knock it on there. Took a little bit off this one. Need a little bit of a bounce. Got it, I think. Got it, I think. Just off the edge. Thanks, Lisa. Good job. We'll see you over there in a second. Matt Henson, welcome. Thank you. Welcome to the Hole in One Show. Thank you. It's lead, good. lead reporter, right? One of the lead reporters one for WDS. Yes, I, you, you got to give Kevin his credit. <laughs> He's been there 50 years. But I, <laughs> how many years? <laughs> 50. <laughs> I was told they give you all the hard stuff. Yes, they do. You're you're in the you're in the middle of the the blizzard, whatever's going on. <laughs> yeah, so you're early in the morning, you're the one just getting the snow right in your yeah, face. Exactly, yes. <laughs> so but it's fun. You Love bet. It. So tell everybody a little bit more about yourself and where you're originally from. Originally from uh, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. So long before uh Carson, Carson. Wentz, Die Hard Eagles fan, fan go birds. There you go. So very uh, good. I like to golf, but You'll see by my shots, I'm not the best. Okay. This right, is... So I hope they're shooting wide. <laughs> you don't, you don't want to just focus on the green here. This can go anywhere. We got the wide lens. Great. Yes, exactly. Uh, let's talk about uh, the charity you're going to be playing for today. Let's do Roger Maris. Roger Maris Cancer. Because I, uh, I play in the golf tournament every oh, week. Oh, good. Perfect. So that, that'll be good. All right. Threw a dart at the board and a hit. Yes, exactly. All right. What club do you have? We're going with the uh, five iron. And you're a lefty. I'm a lefty. Southpaw. I can't wait. Let's do this. I can't yes. wait to see it. All right. Good luck. You can. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, Matt, for two. Yeah, different side of the uh, tee box here. Unfortunately, it brings the cornfield into play over there. <laughs> and if Matt's smart, when he's got enough pull, he's going to get someone to edit all of this in the <laughs> shed later. <laughs> oh, hey, all right. Yeah, Contact. Oh, oh, hit the light. That was the heater. Yeah, that that, was that, you hit that hard. We'll get a. That's a distance. Now we've got to work on the action. <laughs> Look like a brand new club either. I really <laughs> recommend that. First time with the with the club really helps. All right, hit you a good one. Next up, Trevor Peterson. There you go. Oh, good line. And You'll bump there. off the tree. Oh, it oh, did. Yes. Oh. All right. <laughs> Way to go, Matt. Way to go. At least I hit it. Thank, hey man, thanks for doing this. No, it's thank not you. easy. We appreciate it. Yeah, you bet. Putting yourself out there doing that on TV. Appreciate it. Next up, Trevor Peterson. 
How you doing, Trevor? Good, how are you? Good, good to see you. Thanks for being on the Hole in One Show. Glad to do it, glad to be here. Executive producer of Ag Week. Yep, Ag Week TV. We've, uh, we're in our sixth season now of Ag Week TV. Uh, half hour weekly show throughout the upper Midwest and Canada. Beautiful. So tell everybody about uh, a little bit where you're from and a little bit more about yourself. Grew up in Fargo um, and uh, played golf uh, a little bit uh, in high school and then uh, picked it up a lot more in the last 20 years. And now with kids, uh, I don't get as much chance to do it as much as I'd like, but when sure. I do, I really appreciate it. How often do you get out and play now? Uh, probably seven, eight times a year, I would say. Okay. Yeah. And uh, what club do we have today? Got a nine iron today. All right. And charity of choice? Charity of choice will be Make-A-Wish North Dakota. All right. Good luck. All right. Thanks. Thanks for being on the show. Trevor is a really good athlete. Uh, but uh, he's also got two daughters. He, shout out to them, really good golfers. Uh, did our LPGA Golf Club this summer and last summer as well. And they are going to be uh, phenomenal athletes. They've got some really good athletic genes in their family. Great, great. Good swing. Ooh, that's, if that Might catch a piece. They got that same tree Matt, Matt hit. Good swing though, great tempo, nice and smooth. Second shot for Trevor. That's you can tell he's... Said relaxing in oh this, my in this goodness environment. And, those, and these people too are used to being on camera but there's something it's just different very nerve-wracking about having people watch your golf swing you're on stage and exposed <laughs> and just here you go i'm gonna hit a golf shot beauty yeah that's a great swing catch too. a piece of the green might go all right trevor not bad not bad just left to the green right. thanks for being on the thanks, show sir. Yeah, you bet it. all right First tier down, four more to go. Stay with us, we'll be right back. The law of energy is clear. You can't create it or destroy it. But with Rebound Frame, you can harness it, focus it for electrifying ball speed. New ZX Drivers from Shrixon, built for distance. Banking. It's more than checking accounts, business loans, or mortgages. It's about recognizing a need, helping families keep their homes, and giving others a fighting chance by working with partners focused on paying it forward. 13,000 stories and more than $18 million in giving to date. Excellence in banking, exceptional at community. Bell Bank, banking, mortgage, wealth management, and insurance. Every day is a new beginning, and with Hot Spring Spas and Pool Tables too, it's a chance to start fresh so you can go after life and achieve your goals. Immerse yourself, then unleash yourself to all that life has to offer, and when the day is done, we'll help you get ready for what's next. Heat that awakens, clear, crisp water that invites, and vitality that drives your day, every day. Hot Spring Spas and Pool Tables too. Every day, made better. We might not remember the exact feeling of catching our first fish, but one thing's for sure, we must have really liked it. Because from that moment forward, our futures were set. And fishing has shown us everything from people to places we probably never would have seen. So, maybe this whole fishing thing isn't just about keeping a fish at all. Maybe it's about keeping that feeling alive. Shields, we feel it too. So you need a golf ball that puts you in control, cuts through the wind, and stops on a dime? Okay, you got it. The new Z-Star Series from Srixon, built for distance. Hello everybody, welcome back to the Hole in One Show presented by Bell Bank. I wanna share with you real quick a sponsorship that we have this year, the Dakota Medical Foundation Shot of the Season. The closest shot of the season will win $2,500 to their charity of choice. Right now, it's Eric Laufenberg on our Maple River show, five feet, 10 inches. All right, on to our next two contestants. I'd like to welcome in Kirsten Keeley. Welcome. Thank you. Great Very to much. see you. It's great to be here, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Thanks for yeah. being here. So let's talk about uh, maybe something the viewers, I know they know a lot about you. They follow you and watch the news, but maybe something they don't know about you. Where are you from and, and how long you been at WDAY? I uh, grew up in Buffalo, Minnesota, came to college at MSUM quite a few years ago and never left. Been at WDAY now, geez, 22, 23 years. Been a while. That's awesome. Yeah. So you do excellent work. It's yeah. nice to have a trusted news source. Well, thank you for that. 
it's it's just nice to be able to tune in locally owned and uh, you and Dana every night it's uh, for me for me personally it's like watching family so I'm thrilled that you guys are here today and and let's talk about golf okay how often do you golf not enough for to do a hole in one show <laughs> I'll tell you that much but i um, been trying to get out at least once a week my daughter plays softball so that kind of interrupts the sure. golf game a little bit but sure. I hit an awful lot this week to prepare so, for this show you? So. and you used to work yeah. or you have worked with Lisa before right? I have yeah taking a few lessons from Lisa who at once told me um, do you want me to fix what you going on here have going on here <laughs> Or do you want me to teach you how to do it right? So I've been working on a few skills over the years. Excellent. So uh, mission statement of the show is charitable giving. Let's yeah. talk about the uh, uh, charity you're going to be playing for today. I am going to play for Party for a Purpose, and it's actually a foundation that my sister started after her own cancer battle about nine years ago. Okay. And they, over the years, have had a big fundraising event in Monticello, Minnesota, but they are... Um, they do grants for people who are battling cancer, anything from groceries to paying electric bills to helping them out with wheelchairs or, or anything they might need because we know as people are battling cancer, those yeah. those expenses come up. And they have helped people in our region too, so Very really cool. close to my heart. Absolutely. Well, this is going to be a lot of fun. Best of luck. What club do you have? I'm using my six, which I, I fear might be a little much club, but I learned in my practicing for this event yeah. that my six and my seven don't go any different. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> It was good to practice, so we'll see how this goes. Just I numbers, might make a switch. Just numbers on a club. Just exactly. All right. Exactly. Good luck. Thank you. All right. Kirsten always tells that story. I swear I never would have never said that. <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you this though. She is an athlete. What she didn't tell you is that she's a former college softball player. So sometimes she hits it like a softball and it goes real, real far. All right. Here uh, we go. Six iron. Good swing. Just out to the right. You can miss the green. That might be the right. And assistance oh, from there. Caddy. Oh, that's uh, Dana, the co anchor and right switching there. clubs. And a new club. Well, I don't know about this one, Caddy. Are you going to tee it up too? Come on. <laughs> Can't afford that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kirsten, last week we were shooting something else too, and she, her, her job was to hit a bad shot, and it took her about 45 takes because she, really? couldn't, she couldn't hit a bad one <laughs> for anything. Well, here, here we go. Just get it started. It'll get to the green with this wind. Yes. And there it is. Beauty. Right there. What a great swing. Beautiful finish position. And Sit. Oh, great kick right there. Sit. Come on. Ah, oh. Just through. Way to go. Way to go. Nice job. Thank you. Great shot by Kirsten. All right, next up we have Mike McFeely. Mike? Dave, how are you? Good. Welcome to the Hole in One Show. Thanks for being here. You bet. Uh, let me say this, that many years ago, I used to interview you when you were playing golf, and now the tables have turned that you're now interviewing me. So that's, I'm not sure if that's good for either of us, but it, that's the way it is. That's the way it is right now, for sure. Yeah, yeah, no, I'll, I'll miss a cut any day you want me to. Anyway, but the bottom line is this. All your, all your uh, followers and people who listen to you, they know that you're a big golfer. You play a lot of golf. How many days do you get out, of, out a week? Is this going to be shown for everybody to see? Yes. Are, are yeah, the yeah, bosses yeah. going to see this? <laughs> oh, no. For the bosses, I play like one day a week, yeah. most. <laughs> Uh, otherwise, I play probably five or six days a week. Awesome. Over at Village Green, right? Village Green and Edgewood. You bet. Got to get the plug in for my guys over there as well. For sure. So a couple yeah. of great public courses in Fargo Moorhead. Absolutely. So, uh, what's your handicap these days since you're playing once a week? Once a week, uh, I think I'm about a two right now, but okay. that's really low. That's I should be more like a six or a seven or a 10. All right. All especially right. Especially if I'm playing for money, then I'm a 15. <laughs> smart, smart <laughs> guy. Thanks. Smart guy. Yep. All right, talk about the charity you're going to be playing for today. I'm going to be playing for Homeward Animal Shelter. It is a uh, no-kill shelter here in Fargo-Moorhead. Um, uh, you can adopt dogs and cats from there. Our family has two dogs that we adopted from nice. the Homeward Shelter. Nice. And uh, they've made a difference in our lives, just brought us closer together as a family, giving us something uh, sort of to kind of bond around and spend sure. time with together as a family. And they just do great work up there in North Fargo, up on North University, and that's that's what I've chosen to, to play for today. Excellent, Mike. We'll just hit a couple of good shots, and let's win some money for the charity. I'll try. I'll All try. right. Thank good you. luck. You bet. Mike McFeely, ladies and gentlemen. Really good player, too. Lots of uh, local awards, champions of multiple courses. He can play. We expect something good here, especially for a guy who plays apparently once a week. <laughs> Not like it one day a week. <laughs> I like how he's kind of got the open stance. He's gonna just hit this up in the air, let the wind take it right into the hole. That's the right play. It's gonna miss the green left, but that's the right type of shot for 
sure. Oop, and yep, that looks like the right distance too, although he's got some he's got such a great swing. You need one on the green. Let's get one on the green here. I mean I will take credit for that last shot Kirsten Keeley hit. Oh, yes, she does so take good. lessons from me. I will claim the first one, no, she didn't she didn't take lessons from me on that one. But the it's second sitting, one, yeah. It's sitting right up there, just behind the hole. All right. Good shot here. Swing. Come on, Wayne. All right. Hey, just off to the right. That wasn't very good. We'll try it again next year. Thank Thanks, you. Mike. Thank you. Thanks for being on the show. All right, Kirsten Keeley with a good shot up there. We'll measure it and we'll be right back after this. Every life deserves a special time of honor. At Hanson Runsvold Funeral Home, while we celebrate life, we also choose to live in the moment, like spending time with family, passing down our traditions and hobbies. That's what I love about golf. It's an opportunity to listen, learn, share, pay attention to details, and plan for the next shot. Most of all, it's a chance to spend precious time with family and friends. That's what's really important. Hanson Runsvold, bringing families and friends together since 1920. Sound, the true expert when it comes to ultra high definition. Come and see the latest in high tech smart TVs and high quality projection. Keep things thumping with top of the line car and home audio systems featuring Bluetooth, GPS, remote starts, and more. Plus, Sight on Sound's professional service department can do it all. There's no job too big when you start at Sight on Sound. Over 30 years as your complete home and car electronics headquarters. Presented by Bell Bank. We've got a leader. Kirsten Keeley's in the lead. In the lead with two contestants left. Right now I'd like to bring in Lisa Schwinden and talk a little bit about Fargo Golf. Golf with Lisa and Osgood. Talk about uh, what do you have going on in 2021. We got a lot of great things going. Check out my website, Golf with Lisa. Uh, we've always focused on not just uh, private instruction, but group instruction, instruction for those that have always kind of been considered the others in golf, women, juniors, seniors, uh, beginner players. Places you can come out and get comfortable and learn the game and get better. Yeah. That's great. Well, you got to grow the game, and that's how you do it. Get people that haven't played, get them comfortable, a place to go and place to play, and, and you definitely do that over at Osgood. So thanks for all you do on uh, the, the area for golf. Yeah, it's been a great, uh, we've had a great run there, and look forward to keep uh, expanding our programs and getting more players in. So Kirsten Keeley's in the lead. Next up, we've got Dom Izzo and Dana Mock. This is going to be a fun segment, all right? One of those guys plays a lot, I can tell you that. That's the other right. One, I don't, I'm not going to say anything about it. <laughs> <Yeah>. Dom's shaking <laughs> his head. Yeah. All right, we'll meet you over there. Next contestant, the host of Hot Mike with Dom Izzo. Dom Izzo. <laughs> Welcome, bud. What's going on? Hey. This is the other. Now, I'm too used to interviewing you. I don't know if I like this too much. <laughs> I'm so thrilled you're on the show. Yeah, Thanks awesome. for being here. Yeah. I know it's probably out of your comfort zone. You probably don't play a lot of golf. <laughs> no. But this no. is fun. I cover much more golf than I actually play it. So. To see my swing on television, it's not one of the things I want to see at all right now. No well, way. the people that follow you and love you can't wait to see it's it, up. so it's going to be fun. So talk about uh, Hot Mike. Yeah, it's, we've been doing it almost a year now, and uh, it's been going great, 9 to 11. I wasn't obviously counting on having six months of no sports to talk about, yeah, so, but yeah. we've, uh, we've made it through, and we're, we're back covering sports, and it's been, it's been great. I think people really wanted a local sports show then, and For we're, sure. we're trying to do our best. That's fabulous, and uh, when the sports does come back, you're gonna, <laughs> two hours is going to go by like, like that. that. There's no doubt about it. we got plenty to talk about. 
Charity of choice. Uh, I'm gonna play for. Well, I can't play for the Jack Izzo Scholarship Fund. I was told, okay. so uh, <laughs> I'll uh, I'll play for First Step. I know they help a lot of people here around the area, so that's what I like to play for today. Fabulous. 150 yards. What uh, what weapon of choice do you have? I got a seven iron here. I don't know if it's gonna make it or not. We're gonna find out. Let's go. <laughs> Good luck, Dom. Burn burner <laughs> What a fun time for you, Dave, to finally get uh, the tables turned and interview oh, yeah. all these guys yeah, and gals yeah. that have interviewed you. This is, uh, this is nice. This is fun. I, I'm it's sure they won't forget this, though, either. So. Great that they're great sports and be able to do something like this. <laughs> there you go. There That's you the go. the hardest part of all of this right there. Got on the tee! Just teeing it up is the most challenging part. Good for you. All right, here we go. Dom Izzo. <laughs> Just shaking his head. <laughs> Wait, confidence first, please. That club is from the 60s. I mean, that is a, that, yep, that, that's older that than probably you and I. <laughs> rust, oh, no, oh, that's, that's all right. All right. <laughs> that's okay, you get two, you get two. We're good. How about a round of applause for Dom? <laughs> Let's do it, bud. <laughs> Beat red. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you can make friends with someone here. And this is that. fabulous content. That's not going to make the, the episode right there. <laughs> oh. oh. All right. All right. How about a round of applause for Don Mizzo for being part of the show? Hey, I really appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Anything, David, that was that was fun. Yeah, and, no problem. Uh, good luck with uh, uh, Mike. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. Good luck with the show. It's been All right. great. Thank Thanks, you buddy. very much. All right, our last contestant. He's got to beat his co-host on the news, Dana Mock. Come on in, Dana. Now, you probably thought the last time you'd be standing next to a Schultz was back at uh, the Concordia <laughs> Fieldhouse about 20, 30 years ago, right? Those were the glory days, David. Loved every minute of it. As you said, that uh, those basketball courts could talk, right? That's right. We had some good times and some great games, too. Yeah, for sure. And the uh, Bison, Bison games with Pops back in the day, too. Road trips were fun. Yeah. Jacksonville State, uh, we had a hoot. It wasn't work. It was fun. <clears throat> so tell everybody, uh, who are you playing for today? I'm playing for Hospice of the Red River Valley. Yeah. Um, they've helped my family twice, 24 years ago with my grandfather, and uh, two years ago this week with my mom. Uh, they helped her with her final journey the last week of her life, and uh, I don't know how they do it, yeah. uh, but they're fantastic. Awesome, Dana. Awesome. So you do play a lot of golf, don't you? Um, since my son's gotten into it, yeah. I've played a lot more. Gunner's a great player. Uh, he is a really good player. I'm envious of him. He hits it about 60 yards farther than me. And he's an amazing young man, too. He's a good kid. Yeah. I'm proud of him. So go get him. Thanks, Spencer. All right. A round of applause for Dana Mock, please. Now, this is serious bragging rights. I mean, he is a good player. His co-anchor is, his, yeah. his co is leading right now. I mean, we expect a, 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 if Kirsten wins, there better be a breaking news. Okay. <laughs> I mean, that's good advice. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to get Dom some new clubs. <laughs> Next time he has, <laughs> has me on hot mic, I'm going to bring him a new set from the century. My help. A little left. It's all going to come down to this last shot, isn't it? That's about the right distance, though. Got to land it right in front of the green and have it bounce up. Yep, good club. Yeah, Dana's out all the time playing with Gunner, his son. Gunner's a great player, great young man, and um, just a great family. Yeah, Dana's just an athlete, too. I mean, Good hockey player. Yeah, makes such a difference, those hand-eye uh, coordination sports. Oh, that could be kick a little. Come on. Oh, hit oh, the tree. Oh, dang it. Not oh, quite to the green. All right. Really? Thanks, Dana. How about a round of applause for Kirsten Keeley, our celebrity episode winner? $1,000 for her charity of choice, thanks to Form Communications. And right after this break, she'll have two putts from 20 feet, the Bell Bank charity bonus putt. Let's go knock one in. We'll be right back. The North Dakota Golf Association is an organization that supports golf for all ages. When you become a member, you not only secure your gin, but you're also helping our junior golfers. Each year, your membership allows us to award $15,000 to young players in our state, supporting their growth in this sport. Join us at one of our annual tournaments throughout the state. Find the schedule at ndgolf.org and help us continue to support golf in North Dakota. 
Hi, I'm Jack Chivers, your Minnesota Lake Region real estate broker since 1966. I traveled through the Lake Region in the early 1960s and discovered the charm of life at the lake and have never looked back. Today, I am sharing my real estate knowledge with you and offering never before listed exclusive properties with Remax Lakes Region. Call Jack the Man with 55 years of experience to work with you or visit lakesremax.com. On the golf course, I couldn't see the ball and I had to say, would you mind keeping an eye on my ball? My eyesight was deteriorating and I didn't know it. I had to keep getting new glasses. Another prescription chain, Dr. Thome said, it's time to do cataract surgery. My only relationship with cataracts are my grandparents. It is arguably the most amazing thing I've ever been through. I end up watching now my son's golf balls and everybody else because I can see them and they can't. Outlet Recreation has been your source for fun for over 15 years. Start gearing up for summer fun by checking out their hand-picked inventory of RVs, boats, fish houses, golf carts, and more. Always sold at outlet prices. Stop by their new Marine store in Fargo or the Marine and RV stores in Detroit Lake. And no matter where you are, you can always visit OutletRecreation.com, your online fun source. Everybody, welcome back to the Hole in One Show presented by Bell Bank. We're up here on the ninth green, and we're with our winner on the celebrity episode, Kirsten Keeley. Congratulations! Thank you so much. I can't believe those words are coming out of your mouth, but I'm happy to hear them. This is going to be a very popular win. I'm thrilled, <laughs> and we have a thousand dollars donated to Party for a Purpose. Yes, my sister's charity. She started a foundation after her own cancer battle, which is about nine, ten years ago, and now donates money to help people going through cancer battles, and it's done a lot of good throughout the region. Excellent. Well. Uh, $1,000 thanks to your employer, Forum Communications, and now we've got the Bell Bank Charity Bonus Putt. Let's double it to 2000 Good luck. No pressure. No pressure. Straight putt. Knock it right in. And most important part of the game right here. It is. I'm sure there's a lot of money on the line for this, not just right now, but at the back Ooh, of the Good office. try. Not a bad, not a bad putt. All right, you got this one now rates for the next uh, news show right here. This yeah, she's rolls got, in. I'm expecting a breaking news. She's got a whole year of bragging rights. She does. Show. Oh, and I'm sure she's going to use it to her advantage. And Let's knock it in. It's got a chance, oh, folks. Break, it's break got there. a chance. Break. Oh. oh, great putt. Good try. Thank Congratulations. You Thank you so Thanks much. for being here. I appreciate you inviting me. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. We, you won. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm going to hold that over all these boys yes. for about a year. I love I it. I just say that. That's, I love that's it. pretty good. <laughs> well, thanks a lot. I'd like to bring, thanks for being here. I'd like to bring back in Lisa Schwinden. Thank you, Lisa. Uh, what a great group of uh, personnel. Oh, fabulous. We'll work on their golf swings for next year. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Go golfwithlisa.com, right? You got it, Dave. All right. All right, folks. Thanks for being with us. That was our celebrity, celebrity episode. Next week, we've got another special episode, the junior golfers of the area. See you next week. At Eagle River Utility Solutions, we're here to help people connect. We spend more time at home than ever before. Time working, learning, and shopping, all from the comfort of our own couch. Not just any internet will do anymore, we need high-speed internet. Our team delivers with directional boring and fiber optic installation. If you're looking for quality, trust, and care in your next contractor, visit EagleRiverUtility.com to learn more.